find a way to get your star done in 48 hours. The first thing is it's a decision. You have to be wholehearted, 100% in to make the decision. If you're not, then this training isn't going to do you any good. Now, I want to go over with you why you want to become a star consultant real quick. Becoming a star consultant is the prizes. You get incredible prizes. Make sure you view the price chart before you leave over there on the wall. You get to pick out something great. I love every quarter picking out prizes. Be careful if you share it with your husband, he'll pick out prices for you. <laughs> Eric even asked me today, he says, you are getting the cutting board set, right? Like, I'm like, star's not over yet, I can't order it, relax. Um, referrals, when you're a star consultant, you get to be, get referrals from the company. You pick five areas you work in, zip codes that you wanna work in, and when someone's looking for a beauty consultant in that area, guess what? They'll refer you with other consultants. Make sure you put a professional picture up there. I have gotten tons of great customers and even team members from referrals. I know, Kelly, you've gotten a couple team members, too, from referrals, which is great and incredible. Um, the other thing is just great recognition. It gives you an opportunity to have recognition. It's part of your ladder of success. You actually get a beautiful ladder pin. I don't have mine on. June has hers on. Um, June, you might stand up and show them the beautiful pin you get. You get this gorgeous, beautiful pin that every time you're a star, you get a new jewel that goes on it and a number that keeps increasing, increasing, increasing. And so this is a beautiful piece of jewelry. Your first star, you're going to get this. Isn't that exciting? And you wear that with pride. It's a really, really big deal to be a star consultant. So thank you, June, when for modeling this. When you're fourth quarter, you get charms. Oh, when you're fourth quarter, you get charms. Thank you, June. At seminar. Okay. So those are all really important reasons um, to become a star consultant. And it's just, it's a place for you to win. Oh, there's the prizes. Thanks, Tanya. You can see that you can pick um, the 1800 cat. I mean, those two lamps are gorgeous. But if you have like 6,000 points, you can pick a couple of prices. There's been many a quarters that I've had up in the 9,600 points. And it is fun to go shopping with someone else's money. <laughs> okay. I will tell you, when you become a Sapphire star, when you add a new team member who's qualified, it bumps you up a star level. You have to be a star consultant in order to get bumped up. So some of you are bumped up because you've had more qualified team members and you get higher and it's worth $600 credit. Isn't that exciting? So you can just go way on up there. So that's making the decision. This decision is the most important thing. Our star quarter ends this Saturday at midnight. I have had many women who have $0 in right now and who have done big things in 48 hours to make it happen. So it's a decision. Now we're going to share some great, awesome ideas on some quick, fun things that you can do. We're going to share about five different ideas. I suggest you grab maybe two of them that you're excited about. You have to be excited about these ideas and passionate to run with them. Those of you who are already a star consultant, you might want to bump up a star level or two. You know, your units that you're a part of are all wrapping up big goals, wrapping up pink Cadillacs and cars and millions and number one. So don't think a lipstick sale doesn't make a difference. It makes all the difference in the world. So we're going to go ahead and... The first one. The first one is, is we'll do the contact customers and sell the gift certificates for 150 to 100. Okay. okay. This one don't have a screenshot for this one. So this one is for those of you who currently have a customer base or people that you know that love the product. You can actually call them. Now what I'm going to share with you is that you can text and email, but you are not going to get the response as you will when you get somebody live. Mm -hmm. I've had people who send out massive texts and say, oh. I sent out texts to over 50 people and got nothing. Yep, you're probably right. You're not gonna get that. So I would encourage you to pick up the phone and call first. If you get their uh, voicemail, you can leave them a little message. I've got some exciting news, call me back. Or if you're gonna text them, say, oh my goodness, I've got the greatest news, call me back. Or text me back. Get them started in a conversation with you through text, Facebook, or e email. Does that make sense? Okay. The first idea I have for you is that you're going to, and we're going to email this out for you, so if you don't get word for word, it's okay. I'm going to put it on Facebook. Um, calling your customers in the script is, hi, Tammy, OMG, I'm finishing up a huge contest of Mary Kay called the Star Consultant Program. I know you don't know what that means, but it's really big, and I wanted to offer you the deal of the century. You can get $150 worth of product for only $99. Didn't that sound exciting? Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's called the deal of the century. So people who love Mary Kay are going to be over the top excited to get $150 of retail product for only $99. Things that end in a nine people think are a better deal. It sounds so much better saying $99 than $100. Now, they might not need anything right now. They can purchase credit from you. A lot of my customers, I do a big sale every June. They will buy credit from me, save it, and use it for the next six months. So your customer can say, well, I don't need anything right now. Well, you can get it on credit. They pay you now the $99, and they have it for credit when they need something else, and then you're able to invest in your inventory. If, that, if they say, well, that sounds great, but a little much for my budget, say, okay, great. How about getting $75 worth of product for only 60 
but don't start there and don't give them both options at once. Does that make sense? Start with the first one, see how they respond, and then you can move down if you need to. Mm -hmm. You can use it now or you can save it for credit. What do you say? Am I excited? I'd be excited. Imagine if you're a hairdresser that you love, where you get your hair done, called you up and said, there's a special, but if you purchase now, you can get $150 worth of hair, you know, service for only nine, nine bucks. Let me tell you what, I would be busting out my credit card in a heartbeat to get that, right? Or what about nails? So you get your nails done, you know, just think of wherever you get services from. Or what about the grocery store? What about the grocery store called you up and said, it's a special, for the next 48 hours, you can get 150 bucks worth of groceries for like $99. Y'all would be busting out your checkbooks, wouldn't you? Do you, well, yeah, Eric would be all over that way. Um, Wegmans. But do you see, but do you see, people are not in Mary Kay, they love our product. It's like the grocery store to women, I'm telling you. They are like, I've got to have my Mary Kay. So you're offering them a great deal. You're not being pushy. You're offering them a deal of the century and the choice to make this great purchase, right? Okay, so that's option number one, and that's great. Option number two is, you know, our cute new ped pedicure sets that are out. Aren't they adorable? Have you guys seen our pedicure sets? They are to die for cute. Everybody loves getting their toes done. Everybody loves pedicure. Everybody wants cute feet for summertime. Guess what? Springtime. Sandals are coming out. <coughs> nice weather. Hopefully it's coming soon. Um, so it's a great little script. You can text this, but again, you are not going to get the response from text. You might get a few, but if you truly want to get this going, you need to get on the phone and call your customers. And you can do the same thing. You can say we have the most adorable petty sets that are out. You want to stock up on them for birthday gifts, graduation gifts. What about teacher gifts? What about shower gifts? Bridal shower, baby shower. It's limited edition. It's only $28. If you buy two, you get the third one for half price. I wouldn't just say, well, do you want one? If you buy two, you get the third one for half price. Mm -hmm. How many would you like? There are cute gifts. Mother's Day's coming up, right? <coughs> Easter's coming up. I mean, these are great gifts that you want to think outside the box. Don't think the pedicure set's just for women. The pedicure sets are great for men. How many men do you know? <laughs> men have wives. Men have moms. Men have sisters. Men have daughters. They would be excited if you called them up and said, I could take care of your Mother's Day gift for you. What about a Mother's Day gift for your wife? Now, they're not even thinking about that, but you're thinking about it, right? So contact the menu now. But again, don't just text them blindly. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. Yeah, sorry. Start a conversation with them. Does that make sense, guys? You were showing us pedicure set. <laughs> pedicure set. Yeah. Okay, the pedicure set. And we do have a little text script from it, but I promise you, if you send this out, to 100 people, you might get one or two getting back to you, but that is it. You need to work the phones. I mean, be excited to be on that phone and make some magic happen. Crystal showed a perfect example of that, that she needed something right away to make happen, and she sold 20 satin hand satin lip sets. It's from just telling people what you have to offer and being excited and offer a little deal. I'm not saying to offer a big sale, but if you offer a little deal, people are gonna go, oh, I need, I need three of them then. Why would I buy one when I can get two and get the third one at half price? How many times have you gone out shopping to get one thing? and you buy more because of the sale of the deal. Right, Target, Kohl's, we buy a whole lot more than what's on our piece of paper that we went to go. Okay, so Tanya, you are gonna take over and do 24-24 challenge? Yes. Facebook? Okay, Okay. so I'm gonna talk about the 24-24-24 challenge. Okay, this is something I know that's a lot to say, but you don't have to say that to your customers. Um, but what this is, is where you work for 24 hours to get 24 customers to purchase $24. That is like a little tiny purchase, okay? And um, what Jen has just said about calling your customers is really important. You really need to call them. A, a, your voice is going to have more energy in it than a text message. And it's going to get them excited about what you're doing. So, but we do have a really easy text that you can send out to your customers. Um, and it's, hey gorgeous, OMG, so excited. I'm finishing up a challenge in the next 24 hours. It's really important that you tell them that it's now, not next week. Like it's now that you need them to participate. And I have a special deal of any half price item from Mary Kay. Simple. First 24 gals to respond with a $24 order earns one item of choice at half price. So the first 24 people to respond to your text are going to get the opportunity when they purchase $24 to get any item they want at half price. So here's the math behind it. And I wouldn't care if they picked a satin hand set, microdermabrasion set, 
right now you want to get your star done right you're still going to make some profit but they're going to get on more products so let's say they order twenty four dollars okay so they order just twenty four dollars likelihood of them ordering just twenty four dollars is very small they're probably going to order at least thirty okay so you've made fifty percent off of that if you give them a half price item in addition to it you're not going to make any profit off of that item but you're still giving them a great deal and they're going to get in on the sale. Does that make sense? Like it's going to entice them to get in on the sale. Plus that I've, I've never had a problem giving a customer something half price when it's like this or at a party, something extra for half price because they get on more product. They get on more product. They fall more in love with what you have and they become a better customer. Okay. So that's a really easy script that we can just kind of send out. Um, oh, and the last part is first uh, 24 gals to respond with $24 uh, order earns one item of choice at half price. You in? Question mark. And then she's going to say, nope. Or she's going to say, yeah, I'm in. And that opens up a conversation, you know? So you can start texting with them. But what I would do is I would, I would text my best customers and I would follow up with a phone call right away. I would start with my best people first and then I would go with people that don't order that frequently and then maybe somebody you met last year that just ordered a lipstick last. Okay, so focus your energies on the people that you know are gonna respond and who are gonna take part in that challenge. Because if you sell $24 to 24 people plus they order half price items, you're going to be bringing in at least 550 wholesale, I think it is. At least. Okay, so that is a really exciting challenge that you can use. And we have, um, we've got a great little, um, <coughs> if I can find it, sorry. Just have to pull these up. We've got this here that we'll put on the Facebook page for you that you can use. Okay, so there's scripts in here that you can use for the challenge to know what to say to call them. Um, it's basically the same thing whenever you call a customer. You want to tell them why you're calling, what you're excited about, and that you have a deadline to wrap something up. Tell them about your personal call. You don't have to go into great details, but say this challenge is wrapping up in the next 24 hours. And you can tell them about a unit goal if you want to. Our unit is earning their first pink Cadillac. You know, something we're all a part of the team and we're doing it together, so I'm passing on a great savings to you. Okay, anybody have questions about the 24-24? Betty, yes? I just have one. When you give them the half price item, is it an item or do you allow them to do sets as well? Whatever you think. Church choice. It's your oh, choice. Okay. Whatever you want to do. Church choice. Yeah, whatever you want to do. Okay. It's up to you. Yeah, because we're independent and you can, you can give them a roll of that. Yeah. <laughs> do you want to do this? No, you pull that up. I'll share something. Yeah. Okay. So, also, a lot of you have jobs. There's nothing wrong if you're allowed to at work. Bring your uh, look, look to work. Let people know, hey, I'm super excited. I'm in a big challenge of wrapping up Star. Did you need anything? I have a great deal. Buy one, get one half off. Why not? Share with people that you see. Who are you going to see in the next 48 hours? Have, do they know you're at Mary Kay? Have you told them? Offer them a little deal. Why not? They're going to get excited. Women are buying skincare and color cosmetics every single day, millions of dollars all over. Why not with you? You just have to honestly open your mouth and share that everybody loves a great deal right now. And what's in it for you is that you're able to wrap up your star and you're able to help a customer get excited about it. And for those of you who have a far reach for your star, it might mean you're rolling your profit in, but if you're a far reach for your star, you probably need inventory on your shelf and you could build your store and that'll be exciting because then you have all this great product you can start holding parties with. And after you hear what Kamiko has to share, you're gonna want a full store inventory. I promise you. Yes, and when you're a star consultant, don't forget you get company referrals. That's right. And so it's really worth it to be a star consultant. Okay, so now I'm gonna talk about the thousand dollar day sale. This is a really fast thing. If you act on this, you gotta start it tonight and get it planned and get it out for Saturday. Okay, so I just put this together. It took me 30 minutes to put all this together and um, to make my page and I'm going to show you what it is. Okay, so you create an email, you send it out to your customers, $1,000 day sale, exciting news, my awesome, incredible unit receiving, is receiving a promotion. I did this to my customers. I just sent this out to them. We're receiving a promotion. We're completing uh, to be a premier club unit. Couldn't be more proud of my unit members. Ding, love you guys. Um, we have together sold over 50,000 retail. Woohoo! Okay, whatever. In celebration of this achievement, I'm holding a $1,000 day sale on Saturday for you. 
Here's the link to my Facebook event page where you can find fun videos and product info for the event. I'll be posting info throughout the day. Just make sure to get your order submitted to me through my website or by email on Saturday. And then I have a little sale here that I wrote for them, which the font doesn't look very good. But, um, And then what happens is when I reach my $1,000 in sales for the day, I'm going to draw someone's order and they're going to get their entire order for free. So they get in the drawing by every $10 that they spend. So if somebody places an $80 order, they're getting eight entries into the drawing. And then when we reach the thousand, I'm gonna sub, I'm gonna draw someone's name, and they're gonna get their entire order free. Okay, so there's a little bit, uh, thing that I put on there, but if you go, what you do is you put a link to an event on your Facebook page. So here's my event, the thousand dollar day. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I've invited Jen to my thousand dollar day right now. I was excited. <laughs> I got an invite too. <laughs> but I'm gonna invite. It's public. I made mine public. And I put right on here, this isn't in my email, but I did put on here that um, you'll see it valid mm -hmm. only if you have, don't have a Mary Kay consultant, okay? So this is public, but if someone goes on there and they have a consultant, I'm not, you know, they can't participate in my sale. I want them to know that they can't participate because they already have a consultant. So I put all the details there, and then what you do is, it's actually really fun. You can put stuff on your page, on your event page, I put my picks for spring, CC cream, bronzing powder, the sunshine duo. You can also put um, links to um, YouTube videos from wow. Mary Kay that on your page, so cool. on your event page. So through the day, people are going to be like, you know, looking at your stuff on your page, posting comments, and we're all on Facebook. Well, I'm on Facebook. I don't know if you are, but I shouldn't assume that, but most of us are on Facebook. And when you get a little like notification, you can reply right away to mm -hmm. the customer's comment or whatever. Oh my gosh, that would look so great on you. Let's get together next week. You know, it's very interactive. The website is awesome. Our Mary Kay personal website, they are like, we've won awards. Our websites are amazing. But it is, it is a website, a shopping website. This is more like just kind of, you can throw stuff up there during the day. People can come on your page and, um, and look for you know new products and stuff like that. So isn't that fun? That is so cool. So you can just create, it took me 30 minutes to create this. You just go on to Facebook, on your personal and on events, you create an event. All right, and then I'm going to put on a link to my website on the page, you know, at the top. I'll probably just keep bumping it to the top, sorry. Keep bumping it to the top, so it's always at the top. Did you have, okay. This is the first time I've ever done something like this. So it's really cool. I don't. I think that you have to learn how to do this to get, make it really good. And I'm going to invite my personal customers that are friends with me on Facebook to that, and I'm going to actually send them a personal message and ask them to invite five of their friends or ten of their friends to join the to join the event. You know, so it's it's um, gets how bigger. How you get the pictures like the Mary Kay pictures on the? <laughs> Your website. Did you upload them? You mean this one at the top? Yeah. Um, that's actually just called a banner. So when you first set up your event, it'll be blank and it'll give you an option to upload a picture. Okay. You just put any picture you want up there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How did you get the spring products flyer to show up in the body of your event page? Yep. All you have to do is um, is you can get a flyer like that and then just take a screenshot on your phone. Most mm -hmm. phones have a screenshot. If it's a, if it's a PDF. You can't upload a picture of a PDF. It'll just go as a file, so it doesn't really look good. Mm -hmm. So if you take a screenshot of the PDF, then you can upload it as a photo. There are also a lot of photos already there. There's a lot. Send. There's tons so of photos on. on. You just go to the Mary Kay YouTube page. You can add you know, videos on here. I would do the CC cream, the Hello Sunshine. I would do like those new little product videos. And you can, with your phone, you can click on the photo <coughs> wherever you find it. It will give you an option to save to your mm -hmm. camera roll. Yeah. Save it to your camera roll, and you can upload it on it Facebook. Mm -hmm. it's, it's really easy to do. But and if it is way. a PDF, you do have to, like, there's, yeah. you have to either have to convert it on your laptop or just do a screenshot, and that's usually the easiest. Yeah, screenshot's very easy. So, okay. That is just so neat. It is so neat. And I it's love so, it. everybody's so computer savvy and 
all this social media. We need to be on board with it. So now we're going to give you another idea, and Tanya's going to show you where to find training for this because we do not have time to train on this idea. Some of you know this idea. Kate, go show to Katie's site. Katie's web. Oh, I'll yes, I'm sorry. Okay. Um, is that we do something called Operation Sunscreen. It's a little earlier than we normally do. We normally do it for summertime, but you know what? Why not? There's sun, and when they're in Afghanistan or in wherever, the sun's out beating on them all year long, burning their skin. We do something as Mary Kay Consultants, which is really, really important, is that we um, always in June run this, but why not do it now? Where you can actually collect donations to get um, sunscreen and lip balms and skincare items donated to be sent to the troops. <coughs> and we have great training on exactly how to do it with verbiage. Everybody loves to give. It is tax deductible, so they're going to be able to write it off on their taxes. But um, you can actually, and again, we have like a 20 minute training on this. I suggest you guys watch it as something that's touching your heart. A lot of people are in the service. So, you know, this is a great, great thing to do. That Katie is so sweet and videotapes <coughs> all of our training for us, and she's awesome and amazing. Oh, I got it. And she has a YouTube site that saves all of the training. It's probably the easiest place. You can also find it on mygenbessaker.com under training. You can you can find videos there, but it might be easier. How do you get to Katie's YouTube page? Because oh. I don't know any of this stuff. But. Okay. You either go to my personal Jen Bessiker site, go underneath training, click video training. It's Donna talking about Operation Sunscreen, or Katie's gonna, I mean, um, Tanya's gonna show you an easy way to get all of our access to all of our training. Thanks to Katie. All right, so all you wanna do is you want to go to, um, on YouTube, if you go to everyone that uploads videos to YouTube has like a channel. Okay, so there's a lot of different channels on YouTube. But a personal, you can have a personal channel. So you just want to go on YouTube and then you're going to just click on the search button at the top of the page and you're going to put in Caitlin Johnston. Okay, so it's K-A-I-T-L-I-N J-O-H-N-S-T-O-N And this is Katie, in case none of you know, and you go to her page actually. It's on her channel, all the videos that we've been um, taping, okay? And you can just go through them and, you know, scroll through the different videos that we've taken over the past year. This is a great resource for you in your business to look for specific videos. And if you go down here, you're going to see the one for Operation Sunscreen. Okay, so you can watch that video. And um, this is just a short one that tells you how to work the Operation Sunscreen program. It's right on there. Yeah. And it's a really great way to give back to the troops, give back, but also you make no profit in this. this we do not make profit off of doing this. This is pure donations. So every bit of money you collect gets turned over to purchasing the products, going into, it covers your cost of shipping and tax, but the products actually, you do, you're doing order and ship it to Soldiers Angels. It's not gonna come to your house. It gets shipped directly to Soldiers Angels, and they have a whole department that takes care of this to ship it where it needs to go. So it's a really great thing to do, and I wish we had more time for that, but we don't. But you can click and watch that and get your training. So these were five fantastic, great, fun ideas. I, don't, I wouldn't do all of them. Pick the one that touches your heart the most, that you're excited about, and run with them. But number one, the most important thing is that decision. You have got to make that decision to be a star consultant. Be a find a way, make way kind of woman and make it happen. Do not make excuses. You can do it. We want to celebrate you, and we know that you can do it. So, without further ado, we are going to have, I have asked um, Kamiko since she has had five weeks in a row of over $1,000 in sales every single week. I know you guys have been dying to know how she's doing it. And I actually grabbed her when she was walking out last week and I said, tell me what you're doing, girl. So I'm going to have her come up and share. We're actually going to put your little display up there for you. We've got it all. Oh, woo! So, woo Yeah. But it's not just that she uses it, it's her verbiage, it's how she says it, it's the way she says it. She's so sweet and just so passionate when she's doing it. I've heard her and it makes such a difference. I'm going to let you take it away, girlfriend. Okay, so basically, <clears throat> excuse me, after I've already pampered everybody and uh, I say, okay, we're going to play a game. And so I pull out the sheet and I hand it to everyone and I said, okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to play the fabulous game. And so I tell them that basically 
I'm in a challenge. Remember, we always want to let people know what we're doing because they want to help you. So I'm like, I'm in a challenge. I'm trying to do 100 free makeovers this month. And this is how you're going to help me. You're going to put down the name of a friend or family, put their phone number, and tell me whether I should text or call them. I was like, and I will not be a stalker Mary Kay lady. I'm only going to call them or text them one time. And most times I've already texted them and that's how I got them. So I'll say, remember how I texted you? I'll just say, hi. You know, I got together with Jen and... You know, she recommended I text you or call you, whatever you want to say. And um, I can't remember now. <laughs> Just really drew through blank. But um, you know, basically, I say hi. My name is Kimiko, and um, Jen told me to give you a text. She recommended I text you. I am doing a hundred free makeovers, whether it's for your portfolio, whether it's for your training, whether it's to be on target for your first free car, whatever your goal is. That's what I put in my text, and I say, "Are you interested?" And then I leave my name, and then I text them. And I will go through and text everybody. And it's really great because I just copy and paste, copy and paste. I don't do a group thing because then others can see. And you don't want to do that. That's bad. <laughs> and you want to personalize it by putting their name in. And also make sure that they fill out the bottom because it asks for their full name. Because you could get a lot of these sheets and then you don't remember who referred. And then you're in trouble because they're not going to respond if you don't say who actually referred you. So that's basically what I do, and I sit and I text. And the great thing about it is once they text me back, um, I'll say, well, you know, I'm in this huge challenge, so if you could get you know, a few of your girlfriends together, it would be great. It's always fun to do it in groups. And so that's how I build it into parties, and I go from there. And then I follow up. Hmm. That's it. I have a question for me, too. Yes. Do you have that form somewhere where we can get topics? Sure do. Sure. Yeah. It's going to go up on Facebook. So if you're not members of our Sisters in Pink Facebook page, please become a member. Of, you have to be my friends, and I can add you or have your recruiter add you. If for some reason you're not on Facebook, it's not your thing, that's fine. Just email me directly, and I'll email it to you. It's just the best way I can get information out to you. But what I love that Kamiko does is that she's not afraid to share her goal. I've heard her working with her customers. I've watched her in action. She's very excited and passionate. I have a big goal to pamper 100 faces this month. Her goal is to pamper 100. Is she going to hit 100? Probably not, but it is a goal of hers. She's excited. If you're not comfortable saying 100, say 30. I have a big goal to pamper 30 faces this month, and you can give the gift of free pampering to your friends. Could you please just go ahead and fill this out? Why I love this versus the back of the customer profile card is that there's 20 spaces. Mm -hmm. The back of the card, there's only seven. There's 20. So Kamika says, they just keep writing. And I believe, what do you do out for tickets? You give the first oh, person so to fill yes, it out? Oh, so yes, the first person who fills it out, and they have to fill it out completely. And I tell them that, that I need the name, the phone number, because I've had people who want to go so fast, they'll fill all the names in, and then they're like, I'll go back. No, I want you to fill it all in. So it has to be complete so that I for it to count. And then once they fill it in completely, then the first person gets 10 tickets. And then I tell them that there's a runner up. And so the runner up gets five because I want them to keep going. Because once the first person stops, if you say there's only one, they will all stop. And then they won't give you any more names. That's, right. That's yeah. right. And then I also love Kamiko's text is so simple. I've seen a lot of texting mm -hmm. for referrals and it's long and lengthy. It was like <coughs> one sentence. It was like, <laughs> Um, you know, hi, hi Kamiko, this is Jen, um, Katie, Bell. yeah, yeah, yeah Bell, or Katie gave me, um, had me, wanted me to text you, Perfect. I'm in a contest to do 100 makeovers this month, are you interested, free makeovers, that's it, there was no other verbiage, and I was like, this is all you send, yes, and that's it, and she gets responses, and then she books them, so out of 20, what would you say your ratio is of responses? Oh my goodness, um, I think at least, I want to say at least five out of there, they'll, they first will they'll respond like, oh, okay, you know, tell me more. Or, you know what I mean? And then, like I tell everyone, I won't, if they don't respond to me, I won't, like, second call them again. It's mm -hmm. just only if they respond. So, I don't even know. I, okay, I would think, but, like, five. five. Okay, so yes. imagine if you're at a class with five people, and they, fit, they each give you a sheet full, or maybe one doesn't. Four out of the five give you a yeah. sheet full. Yeah. You get five people who respond back to you out of the four people. That's 20 appointments on your mm -hmm. date book. And if they have two friends... Yeah. Okay. Do you see the math? Yeah. Do you see that literally this is how Kamiko has been building yeah. her business recently with great women is through referrals. $1,000 weeks. Thousand dollar weeks. This is a gold mm -hmm. mine for you all. But if we're not doing it, you're not asking, you're not going to grow your business. But it's how she asks. She's very sweet. I'm in a big contest to do 100 faces and you could help me out. Like she's so sweet about it and she's genuine. And I would be like, great, let me bust out my phone and give you lots of names. One tip I have is to go ahead and tell them you're playing a game, get your cell phones out already. 
go ahead and get your cell phones out. We're gonna play a fun game. Like have them have the phones out, ready to go. This is separate from the You Are Gorgeous sheet. I love the You Are Gorgeous sheet, but if you don't do a referral game, you're not gonna get the referrals. It's on there and that's great for new consultants who forget to ask, some people fill them out. But this is a separate piece of paper. Why you want it separate than your back your customer profile card is that you wanna process your cards and do what you need to do with them like Kelly shared and file them away. You have a whole separate binder full of referrals. Yes. If they don't write their full name on there, you make sure to put their full last name on there so that you have information if they say, yes. you know, Alabelle who, or right. Kelly who. Or they you have the last name. Yeah. I've had that before mm -hmm. too. Well, I know a lot of Katrinas. Who, who, who right, know? exactly. You three hole punch it, you stick it in a little binder, you've got referrals. The one thing you do want to respect, if you text somebody mm -hmm. one time and you get no response or a call, put a mark across their name and do not text again. Yes. That is really yes. annoying and that's going to make you a stalker. She would have responded. Seriously, you have to respect that. Text one time, you move on. And I want to also share that sometimes they don't respond right away. Right. Mm -hmm. A couple days later, like, oh, yes, I'm interested. I had that today. I mean, I, it's so bad that because she waited so long to respond, I deleted her out of my phone because I didn't want a chance of retexting her again. And so she, so I don't know who preferred her, but that's yeah, okay. Yeah, and when you, when you start texting people and you have so many to text, do you put their name on the phone or what do you do? Like, how do you do that? Because um, you don't want to save all these people on your phone. No, so because I put their name, I say, hi, Katrina, so-and-so recommended you. I don't have to do that because once they respond, I already know who referred them and what their name is. Right, then you can go and pull out Katrina's sheets. Right. And then you can look and see her name and her number. Actually, what I do is when I text, I already, I'm on the sheet. And I mark each one that I've already texted so I don't go back. So if she responds at that time, like or later, I already have her name and I already know who referred. So right. I don't. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. And do you know there's a way with most phones that you can set up texting? Like if you're watching a movie late at night with your husband or whatever, you can do all the texting but have it scheduled to send at 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. Be careful on when you text. Don't text before 9 and don't text after 9. It's the same thing. You have to be respectful. A lot of people leave their phones on. If you text them at 11 p.m. at night, you already lost them. They're going to be like, that's annoying, right? Mm -hmm. um, so be the same phone rules apply to texting as they do for using the phone, but you can um, program your phone to send the text out at nine o'clock in the morning or your lunchtime or whenever it is available. So it's awesome. So your business has been building like crazy through texting. And once you get it going and you get bookings from bookings, they have no problem giving texts because like she said, just like I got your information. The other tip that I do, I don't know if you do, is I tell them if you could be so sweet and give your friends a heads up, I'll be texting them. Then they know what's coming. So if June, if you could be so sweet and let Katie and the other girls know, I'll be sending them a quick text and that you're giving them a free pamper and that would be awesome. So June's going to tell. Now, it doesn't happen all the time, but it's nice that half the time that they do, they're prepared for your phone call or your text. Right. Is what I do I tell them to, you know, I'm going to text your friends if they, you know, respond or ask you, who is this Kamiko person? Please let them know I'm not a stalker. Please, you know, you know, tell them that you had a great time with me because really, if they had a great time, they're going to tell their friends. Right. Absolutely. Anyway. They're going to tell their friends and they'll be excited to see you. Like I had one lady, she was so excited. She told her, I don't know, coworker right next door. So she texted me immediately. The lady didn't even tell me her name. I was like, who's this again? Yeah, <laughs> what a great problem to have. Yeah, and what happens is when you have so many um, numbers to call and texting, if they don't get back to you, you don't worry. You're not hung up on the fact you've got one sheet with ten names. That's all you have to book. You've got hundreds of names. If they don't get back to you, you're like, oh well, they're lost. Oh, I mean, right. it's the truth. Kamiko said, I don't worry about the ones that don't text me back because I don't have time to. Right. 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 And the great thing too is if you don't like, you know, warm chatting. This is great. I don't have to warm chat. Yeah. I don't because I just keep. Right. Getting more and more every time. It's the easiest way. Next to a ma become a master at bookings from bookings is yes. the first way, getting people to book parties. This is the second easiest way to build your business is through referrals. This is old school, comes way back from Mary Kay, her teaching. I just love her sheet and how you passionately share your goal you. of you've got a challenge to do 100 free makeovers this month. Could you get their help? That's key. Any questions for Kamika? I have a question. Yes. When you do give out your ticket for prizes, for example, what do you do as a for prizes? I do the mini satin hand sets. I mean, you know, like the little lotions. Very easy. All the, the little section two things that you get a bulk of. So either it's that, or um, you can do the little perfumes, whatever. But yeah, the samples. I'll tell you a great easy, easy way. Buy the satin hand cream in tubes. You get a bag of twelve for six dollars. It's fifty cents a hand cream. Put it in a little plastic baggie with some um, that shred, real pretty shred, a couple of hard candies or chocolate. 
your business card in there if you want. I put a little bow around it. That is the cutest gift. Yes. And who doesn't love a little hand cream in their pocket, their purse? Mm -hmm. It costs you under a dollar to give a gift away. And you might have to have two or three ready that you might want to give away more gifts. It's how right. And the other thing, I, I also do this with, even if it's a one person, and I automatically say, just for, you know, referring your friends, I'm going to give you a gift. I just give them a gift. That's a great idea. Yeah. Or you could say, I'll give you a half-price item for filling it out. You don't want to give away a gift half price item, but I love the fact you do it with one because so many people won't do it with just one person because they're afraid they're going to be like, but you're not afraid to ask because you know this is a lifeline of your business and that is keeping you going and going and going, especially with your busy schedule being a nurse. Yeah, and you can text on your lunch break. You can text when you have time to text, not necessarily. Sometimes when you're dealing with kids, you can't text like little kids. You know, and you can't call. You know, you want them to hear your kids screaming in the background. Well, you can text away all you want. It's the truth, though. I want to be honest. I, the reason why I went to texting because I used to be an avid caller. And the thing was I would only call certain times, like 5 to 6. Because I'm like, okay, that's the only time I really had. But the problem was people were eating dinner. They wouldn't always answer the phone. I'm leaving messages. They're not calling me back. And so one day I was like, I'm just going to text. And I text in the morning at 10 o'clock. And I was getting responses mm -hmm. immediately. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh my gosh, people respond. So I was crazy with it. Because I mean, they, even if they're at work, they're looking at their phone and they will respond. They will <laughs> yes, respond. A, text, a text is going to be read 80% faster than an email. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you want to master this because next month I'm going to have some great training on you for you guys on how you can actually invite and pre-profile through texting, how you can send a cute invitation through text. That's going to be it next month. Um, Janae Butler in, in Miami, Florida is mastering it this month. I mean mastering it. And everything she does through texting, including inviting and pre-profiling. That's great. And she's having incredible results. So that's to come. Master this part first, and we'll get to that. So now, uh, thank you so much.